Last year was sort of way too easy for me. I'm feeling sort of challenged now, which is really nice. Learning about how to like find ways to do things, and like we're using like cubes more, and like re ways of representing. I find it's like we're doing a lot more projects and stuff, and I like doing projects better than just doing like regular work, because like we get to like work on it, and I think I understand better. Like when we like do projects, it helps me learn better. Mm -hmm. Math is my favorite because like I find it's a lot different than all the other subjects because you get to like use numbers and there's always like a right answer. When we don't understand stuff, the teachers are very clear and they help us a lot and that's why I like math a lot here. Issues that had appeared in the past with the pace of curriculum, the number of outcomes, the um, the pressures on teachers, all of those had obviously been considered when they did the new curriculum because a lot of those problems have been completely eliminated um, and that they're really able to spend the time with the students that they need in order to make sure that the level of understanding that's necessary is there before they have to move forward. It's very user friendly. Um, I've had a lot of great lessons just looking at the curriculum and their suggested lessons and how to kind of create an entry point um, for the students into the lesson that everybody can participate and everybody can have success. I'm focused on sitting with students, helping them work through problems, um, having more discussions with students. I think in previous years, you kind of had to take the time to, to dig a little bit to see where those connections were. Uh, and the way that things are laid out now, the, the connections are, are obvious, right? We're always looking at, well, this is something we already talked about, and here's where it comes into play again. Uh, even the way the outcomes are structured, that a lot of them are showing uh, different approaches to the way we're learning. The thing that I notice the most is the different level of engagement in the classroom. That students are um, encouraged to have more conversations with each other, that they're encouraged to explore the math a lot more than they have been in the past. Instead of it being the um, sort of uh, delivery from a teacher, it's about them figuring out what they need to learn and being guided in that direction. Teachers will present an idea and then let the students explore it. And from the student perspective, they're much more excited about what they learn. I feel like it's more interesting, more challenges. More, it's more like hands-on. You actually feel like you're doing more than you were last year. You like, for example, if drawing it, maybe you can't see like all the 3D shapes. So if we're actually holding it, you can actually see like how it, uh, what like the difference does it make because. We can see and like touch it and feel it and like count them. Um, I find there's a lot of deeper learning uh, when we're throwing in manipulatives. The calculations, a lot of kids can put in numbers and find an answer, uh, but for them to really fully understand what's going on, what does it mean to multiply a fraction? Sure, they can multiply numbers, but when they understand actually what's going on and how they can apply that in a real life situation, it's so much more beneficial and they can actually take what they've learned in the classroom and apply it outside. We've used many lifts here and there, but I found what's really worked a lot with my grade nine class uh, is discussion-based learning. It is not just doing the, the questions and not just working on the questions, but working on them together and explaining our understanding, describing, well, this is how I got this question. Not just, here's my answer to the question, but this is how I got there. Uh, and then somebody else can give another strategy and it kind of reveals that oh, there's not just one way to do this question. We're doing more group work because I find like I really like working in groups more than working individual. So. She asks people to volunteer if they know what to do and sometimes she lets us help the other students if we understand they don't. It's really neat to see these different learning styles and also need to see some students picking up new learning styles, new strategies based on what their classmates have, have shown them. I love teaching math and I love the new curriculum and it's making my life a lot easier and it's also letting me actually interact more with the kids, which I really like. The teachers can normally get to the students quicker if they have their hand up. I feel like I'm learning a lot like more of the basics. And I find that uh, at times I can be rushing myself to do math too fast, but I really like how the teachers sort of keep me on pace. I like it better because I understand it. So.